God said, you shall walk through it. God said, you are powerful than you thought. Don't go. You need to hear this message that God is passing across to you today. If you're seeing this, this is not a mistake. God said you shall walk through it. Get rid of that fear. Get rid of anything that has put you down. The word of God says he has not given you the spirit of fear, but of love, of power, and of sound mind. The word of God says in Luke 10, verse 19, Behold, I give unto you power to tread on serpents and scorpions and over all the powers of the enemies. Nothing shall by any means hurt you. Nothing shall by any means hurt you. What is the enemy trying to do around you right now? What is the enemy doing to you? What is that thing that you are passing through? God said you shall walk through it. They shall turn for you for a testimony. You have the power. You have the authority. The fire will not burn you. Where the enemy wants you to sink, you will not sink. They will see you jumping over. That pit the enemy have dug for you and your family, they will see you jumping over. They will see you walking through it because God has deposited that power in you. Remove that fear. The word of God says he has overcome the world for you. Fear not. For greater is he that is in you than he that lives in the world. Child of God, as from today, God wants you to walk in that liberty. God wants you to always be bold because why? Everything the enemy is throwing at you, you shall walk through it. They are going to see and marvel what happened, what is going through, what is going wrong, what is happening. Upon everything I'm doing, this person is still smiling, and this person is still rejoicing, this person is still moving because greater power is in you. Everything that the enemy planned against you and your family. You shall walk through it. Reverse is going to be the case because the enemy was shocked when Daniel became lion's friend. When the lions became Daniel's friend, they were watching because what they want to see is that the enemy has eaten up, the lion has eaten up Daniel, but reverse was the case. Whatever the enemy planned for you and your family this season, you shall walk through it in the name of Jesus. Amen. Shalom. God bless you.